In this example, I need to find the center and radius of the circle given by the equation, the quantity x plus 3 all squared plus the quantity y minus 4 all squared equals 9. Then I need to graph the circle and find its domain and range. So quickly reviewing, the standard form of an equation of a circle with the center at hk and a radius r is given by the quantity x minus h all squared plus the quantity y minus k all squared equals r squared. Well, the equation we're given for our circle is in standard form. And notice when the equation is in standard form, the x coordinate of the center is the opposite of the number that's with the x that's all squared. The y coordinate of the center is the opposite of the value that's with the y that's all squared. So in this case, I know that the x coordinate of the center h is going to be the opposite of this plus 3, so it's going to equal negative 3. The y coordinate of the center is going to be the opposite of the thing with the y, so it's the opposite of the negative 4, which is positive 4. So I know the center of my circle is at the ordered pair negative 3, positive 4. So I found the center. Now I need to find the radius of this circle. Well, that is r, and it is the square root of this number here. So in this case, it's just the square root of 9, which is 3. So I know the radius is 3 units. Now I need to graph the circle. So we start by graphing the center, which is at negative 3. x is negative 3, left 3, and y is 4, up 4. There's my center. My radius is 3 units. There are an infinite number of points on a circle, but only 4 that are easy to graph. And I'm just going to go up, down, left, and right 3 units from the center. So starting at the center, going up 3, going down 3, going left 3, and going right 3. And now I'm going to try and draw something roughly circular through these points. Now it's hard to graph on this tablet, so you'll have to excuse my circles. They never look very circular. But that's about the best I can do. Hopefully you get the general idea. And lastly, I need to find the domain and the range for this circle. Domain are the x values, so I come in from negative infinity in the x direction. The first x value I hit is this point where x equals negative 6. And as there is a point where x equals negative 6, you must put a square bracket on the domain. So it's square bracket negative 6, comma, all the way through to this point where x equals 0 with another square bracket. So the domain is square bracket negative 6, 0 square bracket. Lastly, the range, those are the y values. Coming up from y equals negative infinity, the first y value we hit is this point here where y equals 1. So it's square bracket 1, comma, all the way up to this point where y equals 7. So the range is square bracket 1, comma 7, square bracket.